Okay, look at all of these plaques. And there's ours. Today I am going to be running around to probably like three studios. I have like three demos to do today. And what demos are, basically like you have to sing everything on the track so that when the artist starts singing it, they know exactly what to sing and how to make it sound exactly like the writer and, and producer intended it to be. You have to just make everything perfect and just make everything sound spotless so that when you are pitching the song they know exactly what they're to hear and stuff you know when like you listen to like bad singers you're like what is going on what is the, what are they even singing a little bit of pressure but then um yeah it's worth it because like when the song comes out you're like oh like they did a really good job you know like when aoa came out with ping bing and um what else i think like a rookie group called like Dream Note, or maybe the song was called Dream Note, but then they came out. Uh, I did a demo for that. I did a demo for a couple of songs. Oh, um, Ehi, I think, came out with a new album, and there's a song called Love Is Over on there. So good. It's always one of my favorites. Um, and it finally came out, and I sang the demo for that. So, yeah, it's really cool to listen to because 10 times out of 10, they do a really good job, and you're just kind of like, oh like they did really you know they did a really good job when i'm not demoing for other people's stuff i write my songs at jumbas and i have to demo them myself because i know the song best and it's just easier that way um so for satellite and curiosity and um uh, what's that other track i want to call it aquarius because i wrote it under the name aquarius and I think it's really cool when like the artist like listens to my voice and records like that. It's like oh, Red Velvet hurt me and like you know it's I don't know it's kind of stupid but it's cool I guess. Um, yeah, and so I have three to do today. It's gonna be whack. No, I'm just kidding. I actually kind of like doing demos now just because it's very it's become easier for me and it's kind of fun just like seeing how other people you know write their songs and stuff so today i didn't write any of these songs i just like i'm just going in got the lyrics demoing for them doing them a favor of like putting a female vocal on the track um and hopefully it comes out great um yeah so that is what demoing is if you guys have any more questions about what demoing is just let me know um, in the comments below, I will try my best to explain it better than I am doing now. But I'll just... I'm like getting anxiety because I have three. But you gotta do what you gotta do because you know mama gotta make money. Anyways, y'all collect your coins and I hope you guys have a nice day too. Bye! Okay, look at all of these plaques! And there's... Oh! Oh my god, how many do you have? This is crazy. One, two, three, four, five. Probably another five over there. Ten. And then there's the the glorious twice. You guys, look at this small mic. 
it's amazing. You can just like collaborate out here instead of going in here. This little dark room with two doors. Like this darkness. That mic right there. But it gets very lonely in here. So, <laughs> this would be amazing. It's like a small podcast mic. Hello, my name is Ashley. Today I will sing for you. Oi. I lie. <laughs> Today I had such a long day. I had to do like touch up on three songs, and like it was just really draining and. You know, it was just like one of those days. But, okay, not to be such a Debbie Downer, but like, one good thing that... One good thing that happened today was that I got to work with the producer slash songwriter of Oh My Girl's last title track in the fifth season album. And I got to personally tell him that I love that song. Like. It's so good. How? I got to tell him he's a really nice dude and we got to work together today. That was like the perk of the week and it was amazing. I'm just super grateful, but I am very tired. So I'm gonna keep watching Songland because I'm I'm very curious as to what this girl's gonna do now. So anyways, thanks for watching this video again. Stay tuned for the next one.